Mic check one two one two. Cloud tokens here. Make sure you subscribe for more content. If you don't, I will harass you in the comments. This is a known fact. Do not test me. All right, so look. As soon as I heard that he got searched by the FBI, I had a feeling that this is the reason why he died. And he overdosed on taking pills because he panicked, thinking he was going to go to jail. He's going to get a lot of time or just he didn't want to get arrested because he knew he was doing something bad because he had 70 pounds of weed, which is not normal if you're just smoking it. You literally only need two pounds realistically if you want a lot of weed. You don't even need that much. But clearly he knew he had all those illegal drugs and illegal guns on a plane. Now he may not have known if you take a private plane, all the same rules apply as if he was taking a regular plane, which the normal citizens take. He might have not known that. But him being ignorant to that law does not allow him to still break the law and get away with it. And he realized that. Now, we've seen on cop shows and crime shows, when people get pulled over by the police, they'll do the craziest impulsive things, shove weed up their ass, pills up their ass, make their baby mama hold the gun in her bra, stick it up her coochie, all types of things. And that's just regular ordinary cops that's pulling you over. So imagine FBI agents. That's even more scary. And that's probably what he's thinking in his mind. So he swallowed all of those pills, not thinking this could kill me in the long run. This could do that, this could do that. He was not thinking that, he was just thinking this is bad, I'm doing something illegal and I'm about to go down. This just makes it 10 times more sad, 10 times more worse to think about. The fact that he did this so he wouldn't get in trouble because he had illegal drugs and guns. There's been plenty of rappers and especially rich rappers who can get off, especially if this is his first offense. He can get off, he can get probation. He can do all of that to avoid jail time. And just in the moment, he didn't think about any of that. And he swallowed all the pills and he overdosed. This is just, oh my God, that's, mm. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this whole situation. This all could have been avoided, but you can't stop life from happening. Before I end off the video, I'm gonna read the details just so y'all will know. Juice World, cops say he swallowed perks, tried to hide them from feds. Juice World might have made a fatal decision as law enforcement searched his private jet, swallowing a bunch of painkillers in an attempt to hide them from the feds. Law enforcement sources tell TMZ the pilot who was flying Juice's private plane alerted authorities on the ground that the rapper's entourage had guns on them, a big no-no in air travel. When they landed, FBI and FAA agents were waiting for Juice and his company to land. We're told at some point between the plane landing and the feds conducting their search, Juice was seen swallowing several Percocet pills in what people believe was an attempt to hide them. Our sources say the pills might have contributed to his death in a possible OD. An autopsy was performed on the rapper Monday, but additional testing including toxicology, cardiac pathology, and neuropathology is still needed before determining an official cause. By the way, we've also learned that paramedics spent 40 minutes treating Juice, primarily trying to get his heart to beat regularly. They eventually transported him at 2.55 a.m. to the hospital. They arrived at 3.06 a.m. and doctors at the hospital pronounced him dead. FWIW, we're told the guns seized were all registered as we reported. The feds are also seized 70 pounds of weed allegedly found in multiple vacuum sealed bags inside luggage from the private jet. Two of Juice's associates were arrested for gun possession. Both men are already out of jail. So their guns was registered, but not concealed. Rest in peace to Juice World. Let me know what y'all think about this whole situation.